Milan Vea had seven children, but lost five in the earthquake. Her son is staying with relatives, so she can take care of her daughter, Fabian. When the earthquake came, a brick from the house fell on my foot. And then the whole house fell down. What have they been doing to get food or water since the earthquake? I just ask people on the street, like a beggar. Can you tell her I know her life's been very hard lately? But there are many people who here who care about the people of Haiti. And I also know that Jesus Christ loves her and loves her family. And that he will take care of them. They hadn't had any medical care until this day, more than a week after the earthquake. It was a long trek, but Milan and her daughter made it to the stadium where Operation Blessing and an Israeli medical team are set up. While most patients are seen for five to 10 minutes each and dismissed, Fabian's injury was too severe for a quick procedure. You know, we were going to go see where they've been staying. They're living outside the presidential palace in a tent city. But when we ran into the doctors from Israel, they said that she needs more specialized care than they're able to give her there. So instead, we're taking her to the Israeli field hospital so we can try to save her foot. At the Israel Defense Force Hospital, Fabian will get the best treatment she possibly could in these circumstances. Taking care of what is left of her family is Milan's main concern right now. But in a city of ruins and devastated lives, she has no idea what the future holds. I do not know what I will do. It is in God's hands.